Uh, just big comeback from uh, come from behind one for Depew. Uh, I'll start with you, Thomas. Just, I mean, you guys are down 15 there in the fourth quarter. You're struggling the whole game, but you're lights out in the fourth. Just what were you seeing? What's that feeling like for you? Hey, just never stop believing, man. I got knocked down. We came right back up. I just said, he's out there somewhere. We got to get our playmakers <laughs> the ball. We got to get our playmakers the ball, and that happened. I was so fortunate and happy that we, we did it. We came back. Pagano, what are your thoughts about it as well? I mean, we worked on this all summer. Me, Tommy, all the boys were up here all summer and just getting work. And we were working on that nine ball because last year we were having trouble connecting on it. But this year, obviously, it paid off. So all I got to say is hard work pays off at the end of the day. Now, how strong were you guys with the same play work back to back? I mean, there was no adjustment there. What was just the thought process behind that? I mean, safety was just, he was just staying still. Like, and we only had 10 players, mind you, both of those plays. We miscommunication injury on the sideline. And I just saw me beat his man. He yep. he runs like a four or five. He's fast, man. I just I had to get it to him. I had to get it to yeah, him. Yeah, they, they put a different guy on me. I saw him line up. He was covering the inside. So me and him worked on a different nine route that uh, covers a different shade of the field, and it worked a success. So Now, Thomas, so you had the game-clinching interception as well. What were you seeing to make that play? I know they're not a passing team. I knew he was, he was a little scared to throw that ball. And I just went up, and I got it. I just went up, and I got it. Couldn't have, feel, couldn't have felt any better than that. Every time as well, this was a rough game. Again, the hits, the sacks, everything, you know, the art. I think you're ending the game three for 17, but against, it's not how you start, it's how you finish. It's just thoughts about your own performance today. I mean, we obviously struggled. I got hurt, my shoulder like popped. I'm gonna be in the ice bath all, all the <laughs> next two days. <laughs> all the next two days, ice bath, recovery. But it's not how you start, it's how you finish. And that's, that's all I gotta say. Yeah, I think I agree with him. Obviously playing football, it makes you pretty sore, but. I didn't take a lot of hits today. Obviously, you know, I only had a couple of receptions for a lot of yards, but you know, at the end of the day, it's about recovery and we're gonna get back next week. Tough opponent against all of them. Now, Springville made it tough for you guys through the first three quarters. What were they doing that was so difficult for you guys to figure out? They were stopping the run really well. You know, their big D tackle, number 20, he was a hell of a player. And, you know, we had a lot of trouble in the run game, but we decided to open up the playbook, get the spread going, and it obviously worked a success at the end of the day, and that's all that matters. I just, I stopped getting hit, man, in that fourth <laughs> quarter. Just had a, had a split second. Shout out to my old line. I know we struggled in the beginning, but like I said, it's not how we start. It's how we finish. They really came together in that end, and we won. Cool.